Hey everyone, this is Alex or PolyMoMoT and today I have a new DIY EOS video for you and this is how to make R2-D2 and this is in the lieu of the new Star Wars movie and it was such an awesome movie and I definitely suggest you watch it if you're a Star Wars fan. And so the materials you'll need is an EOS and then some epoxy clay. And so I'm mixing part A and B in equal parts and I'm just filling in the EOS part and then I'm using my blade to scrape off so you can get and get a, like a smooth surface. And on the very bottom, I'm just taking some epoxy clay and I'm just scraping off the excess just to make it flat because the indent makes it really hard for it to paint. Then for the legs, you wanna kinda of just flatten out the epoxy clay kind of like thick and then you wanna cut out a trapezoid shape and that's gonna be the base of the leg. And then you want to roll out a thick strip and then just kind of flatten it out and then cut it in half and then that'll be the actual leg part. And you want to put that onto your trapezoid and then you'll have your legs and you want to make two of these and then you want to just kind of put them to the side of your EOS and make sure it's like 90 degrees from the like the flattened part of the EOS where you open and close. Then once the epoxy clay is dried, you want to take white paint, and this is just regular white acrylic paint, and then you just kind of want to paint all over uh, both parts of the EOS. Then once all white, you want to take some silver acrylic paint, and then you just kind of want to paint the top part of R2-D2, because R2-D2's head is silver, and then you should have something like this. And then you want to take a little circle of paper, and then you just kind of want to paint a blue stripe around it. And the reason why I have the circle is because it's a nice template to have a nice, like, circular pattern. So you should have a nice outline of blue stripes in a circle shape like this. And then next, I just kind of painted on squares and stripes of blue and silver on the top and bottom of R2-D2 in a design. I didn't show the process because it's just, you know, regular squares. And I just kind of simplified the R2-D2 design. And then I'm taking some red paint and a dyeing tool and just putting on a red dot and then a black dot in the middle for the eyes and then the light. And then I'm taking a light blue paint and I'm doing another dot in the black circle right next to it. And then we're gonna take off the top part of the head and then we're gonna glaze it. And I'm glazing with resin, but you may glaze it with ferrothane or anything floor polish. Then once dried, I'm gonna screw it back onto the base and then glaze it again. And here is my final product. And as you can see, it has an R2-D2 look to it. I'm super happy with how it turned out and I think it's so cute. And the fact that it stands on its two legs by itself is so adorable. So if you like this video, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and don't forget to check out some popular videos of 2015. Thank you.